Are you happy to be back having a Saturday class weekend? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's always great to wear green, and it's kind of there's a lot on the line this weekend. So there's a good, exciting buzz around the place. Um, obviously, it was disappointing not to be involved last week. Obviously, disappointing as a squad to to lose the game, but we've got we've got a game on Saturday and a chance to make it right again. So I'm looking forward to putting my best foot forward. Yeah, no, I definitely think we can. Um, like I said, we played a good game in the first game and then very good 60 minutes and then just kind of took our foot off the pedal. So uh, I hope, I, I know we will have learned from that and um, it'll be a different game and we'll, we'll play 80 minutes this weekend. He's been raring to go, sure he was raring to go when he couldn't play the week before. He's, uh, he's that kind of player, he gives 100% uh, on the pitch as everyone knows and he gives 100% in training as well. And um, No, it's great to see him uh, involved again. Change of in terms of what you're yeah, well, we've we obviously we always have a close look at the whole squad, and Whiteley was one of the guys that he obviously wasn't involved uh, in the starting lineup for the first two games, but he made some impact when he came on. In fairness to him, and um, he's obviously had a very good season with the Lions as well. So um, he's always been there, thereabouts in our thinking that he would be involved. Um, so yeah, no, like I said, he br he brings he brings a good dynamic to the squad and. He's obviously a leader as well, so um, we've uh, we've got to keep a close eye on him on the weekend. Uh, we can't give him as much free space to to roam around and do what he did like he did last weekend. Um, Jack O'Creel as well. He's he's like any of their back rows. He's a very dynamic, explosive player, and uh, I'm sure he'll be raring to go if he gets a chance off the bench. What would it mean? Yeah. Well, it's it w it's obviously it'd be history. Um, we're uh, we're just thinking obviously about winning the game, and then um, that would obviously mean making a bit of history. It's not not many teams come down here and do that. Get a series win against the Springboks. So uh, it's like I said, there's no uh, there's no second chances after this weekend. It's this is this is make or break for everyone. So. Um, we we'll worry about the game first, and then if if we manage to do it after, then it will be some some achievement, something to savour for years after.